What is going on guys, it's your boy Luna here, and I have a fucking awkward, awkward ass video for you guys today. Um, one that I just really, really just look back on and think, wow, this was probably one of the most awkward things that's ever happened to me. And I'm lucky, and I'm going to tell you why. So, uh, this started in the beginning of the summer, okay? I got invited to like the first party of the summer, and it was just, you know, it was cool. Everything was cool. I went there, it was the first party of the summer, everyone was all hyped because it was summer, and so was I, and we went hard that night, guys. We just fucking, just all sorts of great things happened, and it was a fun night. And what ended up happening was, guys, is towards the end of the night, everyone was leaving, and I didn't have a ride home, okay? My ride ditched me, and he was really fucking drunk, and he drove home drunk, and I didn't feel like going with him. And I was like, shit, what do I do? So the person who was hosting the party was a really good friend of mine, and I asked him, I was like, yo, can you give me a ride home, or can you just, like, you know, tell someone to hit me up and, like, bring me home? And he's like, nah, dude, just stay here, it's good. So I was like, all right. So I was like, fuck it. Where do you want me to stay? He's like, oh, just stay in the living room. You know, you won't really be messed with. So no one else was really staying there besides like four other kids. And I think it was one girl, two dudes, and like some other kid who I didn't even know. And, um, you know, I was kind of mutual friends with these people. So it wasn't that awkward. And I just went to bed. You know, I was really tired. I was really burnt out. So I went, you know, to the couch, laid down and covered myself up with like a little blanket and just fell asleep. Now, a few hours passed, I don't know how long it really, like, was that I was sleeping, and I woke up in the middle of the night to hear this weird, like, friction, like, rubbing noise, and I was like, what the fuck is that? And I'm sitting here like, okay, maybe it's just some people who are awake, maybe it's, you know, it's no big deal. And I didn't think anything of it, and I turned the other way, and all of a sudden I start hearing whispering. Now, when I heard whispering, I'm like, okay, what is that? So I turn back the other way, and there's this weird couch fortress in the middle of the living room floor, and I'm like, okay, like, what the fuck? And I hear whispering, and I could kind of see through the little opening. Um, like, it was dark, guys. The whole room was dark. But I could see, like, a light hitting, like, the pillows. And I could kind of see, like, a head. And it looked like a girl's hair. And I'm like, okay, what is this? And I hear this guy whispering. And then I hear her laughing and giggling. And I can just hear movements. And I can just... You could put two and two together. Like, they were fucking. Okay, they were having sex. And I'm sitting here like, why are they doing this here? There's other rooms in the house. Why couldn't they just pick a bedroom? And I'm sitting here all awkwardly, like, watching this happen. Like, they don't know that I'm awake because, like, they had, like, a fortress around them. And, you know, I just think it's two people, right? No big deal. And for a good 45 minutes, I'm hearing this, like, conversating and whispering. And I couldn't tell who was who. And I'm just like, damn, dude. Like, these people are legitimately fucking right in front of someone else. And I just turned the other way. And when I turned the other way, they stopped. And they were like, oh, shit, is he awake? And I'm, like, sitting there, like, all awkwardly. I'm like, oh, no, I hope they don't find out that I'm, like, awake and that I'm witnessing this and they go back to what they're doing like literally five minutes later they think that I'm like sleeping still and after a good 30 minutes go by so in all it's like an hour almost an hour and a half they finally stop and I hear like the pillows moving and I'm like oh shit maybe they're done and I slowly turn around and there was one dude in the dining room grabbing a glass of water and he was grabbing it off the table and he's drinking it and I hear the girl in the kitchen kind of yell she's like hey come in here real quick and he goes in there and then I see the pillow start to move, and another fucking dude gets up and walks into the kitchen. And I'm like, there is no fucking way there was just two guys and one girl, like, in front of me fucking. And I hear them conversating in the kitchen, like, giggling, and I'm like, did I really just witness a three-way? Did I just watch them literally have a three-way? Because I could see some, like, there was one part where it was just so detailed, I could see... And I'm trying to squint so I can't see, and I'm just trying to shut my eyes and sleep. And it was so, like, the whispering and just everything, I could hear it all going on, and I just couldn't fucking sleep. And they go to bed, and the whole rest of the night, I'm wide awake thinking, oh my god, I just witnessed a fucking three-way. And the next day, the girl actually left, and one of the kids that I know actually pretty well, um, I mentioned to him, I'm like, dude, so, how was last night? He's like, pretty good. He's like, yeah, we kind of had sex in front of you. And I was like, yeah, man, I know. I heard it and saw it. He's like, shit, my bad, dude. He started laughing about it, and we both kind of laughed about it. But it was just so awkward. And I thought I would tell you guys about this. And if any of you have went through this, I hope that you haven't. If you ever witnessed someone fucking in front of you, leave it in the comments below. I want to read it. And I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, leave a like on the video. I love you all so much, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. And I'm going to be playing BO3 Beta tonight. I'm going to be streaming it when it drops. I'm not sure exactly when it comes out, but... We'll see. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed, leave a like, leave a comment, and I'll see you all later. Peace.